Okay guys, this is another device that I've been trying to unlock for a long time. So let's see if it says carrier lock, general, about, and it says here, carrier lock, SIM lock. Carrier lock, this device might be restricted to the original carrier and or have a certain capabilities limited. Contact your provider for more information, okay? Just to confirm this, I'm gonna put a SIM card that is not from AT&T. This is Mint Mobile, like this. See what happened. Activation required, software update complete. It may take a few minutes to activate your iPhone. And it says, unable to activate it. Your iPhone could not be activated because the activation server cannot be reached. This is a problem of the server. Now we have Wi-Fi, so probably it's gonna work this time. Check it out. SIM not supported. The SIM that you currently have installed in this iPhone is from a carrier that is not supported under the activation policy that is currently assigned by the activation server. This is not a hardware issue with the iPhone. Please install another SIM from a supported carrier or request that this iPhone be unlocked by your carrier. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna copy the IMEI we're going to go to general about and the IMEI is right here. Click hold and then copy, then open a browser, AT&T unlock portal. And this is the website guys, AT&T.com device unlock. You have to read to see if your iPhone qualify or just go here to submit an unlock request. Click there. Do you have a mobile number from AT&T? No. And then the IMEI number, just click, click and hold and paste. The portal immediately is gonna recognize the iPhone SE A1662. Okay, click on I've read the legal info and then wait till you get the next button. Click on it. And now you're gonna have to put your name, last name, mobile number, don't put anything, email address, you're gonna put your email address and then type it again. Okay, and then just click submit. And it says, thanks, we got your request. So now what we need to do is we need to log in to our email. Right here, guys, AT&T order status, heads up. You have 24 hours to confirm, okay? 3.01 p.m., click there. Let's confirm your device and log request within 24 hours. What you need to do is you need to click here, guys, confirm your request. And it says, thanks for confirming. Wait until the website finished loading, okay? You finish loading. What I like to do is I like to go back to the email and click check the status. Current status pending, okay? So you can wait for five to 10 minutes and then go back to the email and click the check status again. Check the status. Look at this guys, current status approved. We approve your request to unlock your device. Here are the instructions to complete your unlock. Using a non-AT&T SIM card, remove your SIM card and insert the new SIM card. Complete the setup process and using an AT&T SIM card, backup your iPhone. When you have a backup, erase your iPhone and then restore your iPhone from the backup. But of course, if you want to unlock this device, you should have a SIM card from another carrier, right? So I do have a Mint, and you know what happened when I put Mint before. Now I'm gonna show you what happened when I'm gonna put it now. It's gonna allow me, it's not gonna block the phone. Look, you see, nothing happens. Look at this guys, Mint Mobile. See if you can see it here better. Yeah, Mint Mobile, all right? If you go settings, general, about, you can see also here, carrier, ultra, Mint Mobile. If I call 611, Mint Fox should pick up. Thanks for calling Mint Mobile. Hold on one second while we get started. Okay, that's the confirmation that this unlock work 100% and it's free, guys. A lot of people are gonna say, oh, this doesn't work. You should say, this doesn't work on my iPhone. A lot of people wants to buy a uh, AT&T iPhone 14 Pro Max prepay and they want to unlock it using the portal. Of course, AT&T is not gonna allow that. You know, you need to qualify for the free unlock. So my suggestion, since this is free, try it. No matter what iPhone you have, just try it. If it works, good. If not, find another ways to unlock it, all right? Thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you on my next video. Bye.